Okay guys, so time for the next one. Just uh, plug it in. Because um, now we're going to install the MIUI ROM. It's going to do its things um, up there on the top. We should go ahead and fire it up. Uh, it says digital camera. No. It, it, my computer is calling my iBotouch 4th uh, generation 64GB uh, for digital camera. Okay, that's that's very weird. Wait a sec, do we have the buggy mode on? Uh, that could be the case. That could be the case. Applications. Development. Yes, we can't have set the buggy mode on. Then we won't um, find it. Like. That's something that I'll learn myself. Turn on, turn on use application. Okay. USB storage in use. Should see it in the background. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! The drivers didn't install. Try it again. Uh, okay, that's weird. Uh, um, so my only in my computer, uh, you can basically see uh, instead of a portable drive, you can see that my computer is recognizing it as a movable disk. Or yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, but basically, what we're gonna do right now is very, very simple. We're just gonna open up this folder. And then we're just gonna make you know some easy drag and drop here of my MIUI. Not gonna move it in, inside a, to a folder, so you're just gonna make a copy paste here. And you can you know have a quick look at the name, so you will find it uh, easy. And the name is basically okay. You're gonna start off with MIUI, so it should be kind of simple to go ahead and find. Okay, so we are basically finished with that process right now. That basically means that we are ready to go ahead and uh, restart it. So that's basically what I'm going to do right now. Turn off USB storage. Power it off. Your phone will shut down. Plug it off or plug it remove the cable you have to be careful people so into recovery mode again of course what else you know see the boot skin twice with that triangle on the bottom that you actually can remove at least what I've heard okay so uh, don't forget these things that you usually always have to do uh, and that is that you go down to mounts and storage you go down and format system yes format you go down and format uh, the cache remember not to mount and change those things and then you go down to data go ahead and click on that and format this one could take a little longer um, so that's what it should look like now Let's just go ahead and go back to go back. Um, let's go ahead and go down to two 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 two. Uh, install zip from SD card, and uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna go ahead and make the installation video in the next part, just because my videos shouldn't get too long uh, my camera doesn't like that so uh, you just go here uh, you go ahead and not apply SD card update.zip but you choose zip from SD card the one at the top 
at least here in uh, this Clockwork Mod 5.5 or 5.0.2.6. That's the one we're, we're running right now. And when we, when we are using this new alpha mode, uh, Ice Cream Sandwich, we were using the 5.5 version. Okay, that's why I get why you couldn't install that if you're running on a Clockwork Mod uh, 4.0. That could be the case, why? Okay, choose it from SD card. Uh, hit the volume up key to go to the bottom so you can see all of these. Okay, I found it. You can't really see it, but this is MIUI over there. I'm just gonna go ahead and click on it and install it. Uh, but you will see that in the next part, so stay tuned for that one.